gun. Hey guys. So I'm gonna this gun. No, this gun. I'm gonna be doing a video here on how to paint a weapon fall camo. Now I don't know if you can see very well, but um, I have a kind of a crap paint job on it right now, so I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like. Um, you're gonna need three paints: uh, sun yellow, uh, dark orange, and a flat brown. Um, and I use this thing. Um, it's the gun. It helps with your accuracy of your painting. Um. So, uh, I'm going to take your yellow here, okay, and, uh, we're going to go paint up and down on the gun. Watch my feet. Okay. Okay, I'm going to give it a yellow coating. Any part that uh, you don't want uh, painted that color, just cover it up with tape before you paint it, obviously. Um, when you've done that, now see, normally for this, uh, I'll leave this part black, but what I'll do is when this is all done, I tape everything else but this and then spray over it with black again. You don't have to do that. Next, you're going to take your orange. This one doesn't say it's color, but obviously it's orange. Um, not showing the gun. Okay. Next, you're going to go. I'm going to move this. You're going to go here. You're going to paint even lines every so often. Now you can wait a little bit, obviously, to let it dry. I'm not really worried about that right now, because uh, it doesn't have to dry. And then, uh, now a lot of people use stencils. I think stencils are gay, because in the army you don't use freaking stencils. You use, obviously, you would use leaves. So next you're going to take your flat brown. Uh, you're gonna take your leaf now. You oh to make this look a little better, you can wait till this all dries and actually place it on there. I don't really care for that, you know. So I just place it close to it, spray paint over it. You can go different designs, different areas. And now you want to take out your magazine to do this, by the way, I mean, I don't know if you didn't notice that, well, I should have said that at the beginning, because if you paint it while it's in there, it's a good chance it'll get stuck in there when the paint dries. So again, you just give it its yellow base coat, coat. take your orange, give it a spray here, and I usually give it a spray here at the bottom, and you take your flat brown again. You take, I usually take smaller leaves for the magazine. Now, because there's a lot more brown, I usually go over a little bit with yellow again. And now, because there's very little orange, I go over it with some more orange. Alright. And now... Yeah, I like to put the camera on it so that way it wouldn't show. Mm -hmm. And there's that. Um, here's a an example of uh, I've done a few guns already like this. Um, I've done an MP5K, and uh, this looks pretty sweet. One second, guys. Okay, and here is the MP5K. And I'm also currently working on an M14. Um, but yeah, that's that. And then uh, you got your fall M4, fall MP5K, and you got your uh, fall M14. 
Um, hope you enjoyed. If you guys want any more cameras, let me know. Give me an idea, and I can uh, help you out. Peace.